So I know I'm no longer a 12 year old girl, but do you want to go to the bathroom with me? Oops. Just kidding, but not really because I want you to come along with me and I'll share with you my favorite Amazon bathroom finds. Let's go. If you want your own home bathroom to feel like a spa experience, then you have to get this amazing towel warmer. Now it kind of looks like a tall and skinny hamper, but it warms up your towels or your clothes and it makes them perfectly hot and cozy and warm right when you get out of the shower. I actually don't have an extra outlet in my bathroom. So that might be something to keep in mind when you order this product, but I just put it right by my bathroom door and there is an outlet right on the other side of that door. So that's where I put it in. It has an auto shut off feature and you can warm up your towels or clothes in 15 to 60 minute increments. And it has been so cozy. After that, it was totally fine and it has been such a cool and luxurious addition to our home for less than $200. Ouch. Okay, the next thing is a shower mirror. I've gotten these shower mirrors before, but it was kind of a smaller dinky one and it would fog up all the time even though it claimed not to. This one is highly rated and it was very sturdy. The nice thing about this mirror is that you fill it with hot water while you're in the shower and that helps prevent any fogging of the mirror. If you like to take off your makeup, or shave in the shower like we do, then it's a really nice addition to just make sure that you get everything off your face and it's really nice. Since we're already here in the primary shower, let's just take a look at this next one. It's a amazing waterfall shower head. We used to have a really dinky one just when we moved into the house and it was fine, but it actually broke about two months ago and so we had to replace it. And I ordered a couple different ones, but this one was the best. It has a really nice waterfall shower head at the top and then also has an attached hose and you can change it so it's only the hose only the top or a combination of both and it's really nice for just bathing in a spa like environment we really also like it for bathing or showering our kids because I can use that wand and it just gets all the shampoo and stuff out of their hair without them complaining that they're getting water and shampoo in their eyes this just makes the whole shower just feel very luxurious for a very low price and we have really enjoyed it so I highly recommend this shower head so when you're getting out of the shower if you're like me I usually like to just wrap my head in a big towel to kind of dry it off. However, they're very bulky and then you're using two towels. I got put onto these microfiber head turbans for fast hair drying about a month ago. I went to a favorite things party at a friend's house and someone brought them and they sounded amazing. So of course I ordered them and they're so nice because they're really small like this. They're compact and what you do is you just put your wet hair in the turban and then there's a little fastener and a button that you can really conveniently easily wrap your hair up and it's small so you're not using a huge towel. This also dries your hair very nicely and quickly and it's very soft and so nice if you have long hair or just you don't want to walk around with wet hair. My daughter really likes these as well because she doesn't like getting her hair all wet on her clothes. I highly recommend these towel turbans. I personally don't love taking baths. I just don't have a super long tolerance sitting in hot water but the rest of my family loves taking baths and Brett the other day was sitting in the bathtub and he had like four towels behind his head and it just looked obnoxious. They were getting wet, they were falling down. So I ordered him this bath pillow and it has been life-changing. Not only is it highly rated, it was very convenient to set up and it dries very quickly. It's very, you know, discreet. It's not obnoxiously loud or anything like that. And my family loves it. So that's a huge plus, of course. In our primary bathroom, we have a large soaking tub. However, in the rest of the bathrooms in our home, we just have regular standard tubs. And in those, as you may know, you can't fill up the water very high because it is kind of a stopper or a drain before you can fill up your whole bathtub. So with this product, you can increase the water level in your bath if you have a bathtub like this by a couple inches, which really does make a big difference if you're an adult and you like soaking in as much water as possible. So it's really nice because it also has a one inch hole on the top. So if you do happen to you know, keep filling it up too much, all the water will drain in there and then it drains. So there's no risk of flooding, which is really nice. It's just one of those small things that can really increase the quality of your life just by adding a couple inches to your bath water. This next product honestly just speaks for itself. It's called a Squatty Potty. If you haven't heard of it already, it is one of the like biggest products in like the last 10 years. They blew up on Shark Tank and they had these viral marketing campaigns and they just help you go to the bathroom easier. And it seems really silly, but it's honestly amazing. So these Squatty Potties, I 
I highly recommend. We put one in almost all of our bathrooms because it really just helps. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. You should go check out their videos. Speaking of Squatty Potty, they have another product that they offer. It's called the Squatty Potty Invisi Brush, and it's a hidden toilet brush. So I, I was intrigued. I ordered it because we have toilet brushes in all of our bathrooms, and they're really just kind of ugly, and they just take up space on the floor. So I thought this might be a good addition to our bathrooms. So you just hook it onto the back tank on the right side of your toilet like this. It also kind of turns and twists out, so then you can hide it better, but it's also convenient to take out when you need. It is adjustable. It does require a half inch clearance on the back side of your toilet on the right side, like I said, and it's just a hidden toilet brush. So kind of another cool bathroom solution. If you watched my last Amazon life-changing products video, you know that I've mentioned my bidet before. We put them in our main bathroom as well as our powder room that everyone uses when they come to our home. And it really is amazing. <laughs> it just feels so clean. And if you've never used a bidet before, don't be scared. This one, you do not have to have an electric outlet because not very many people have electric outlets in like their toilet room or, you know, the area of your bathroom where there's a toilet. So this product installs really easily. It's very sleek, it's inexpensive, but it makes a huge difference. So <laughs> along with the squatty potty, this really will improve all of your digestive and bathroom needs, health. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Oops. Just buy them and thank me later. Since we're back in the primary bathroom, I thought I'd share with you a couple of my favorite things that are on the counter. So if you see here on my bathroom counter, we used to have a lot of, you know, bottles, products, deodorant, toothpaste, all the things on our counter and it looked a little messy and really we don't care too much about the aesthetic in our primary bath because only two people use it. However, it was getting a little out of hand and the storage underneath our sinks was a little bit lacking and those are products we use every day so we wanted them out. I initially bought this tiered rack shelf thing for a kitchen video I did earlier this year. However, it didn't fit under my kitchen cabinet. The clearance wasn't high enough. So I thought, well, where else could I put this in my home? So we put it in the primary bathroom in the middle between our sinks and we just put all of our products that we use on there every day. And we actually really like it that way. It's very sturdy, it looks pretty nice, and it's been a good place to put all of our things without having them directly on the counter. So anyway, we put it in the bathroom and we really like like it there. It's been nice to have everything kind of in a different place, not just straight on the counter. Now we love having our Amazon Alexa in our bathroom. It might seem like kind of an odd place to put one of these devices. However, it is so nice to have. I can set timers on there if my kids are bathing and I say, hey, just Alexa, set a timer for five minutes. I always play music in there when we're showering or getting ready. And in the mornings, I always like to ask Alexa what the forecast is going to be as I'm getting dressed. It's just a really nice thing to have in the bathroom. So the only problem is on this side of my husband's sink, there's not a lot of room on the counter with everything else that he has. So I purchased this Alexa shelf <laughs> to put that it attaches directly onto the outlet plate and you can put the Alexa right on top of it. The cool thing is there was a little bit of extra room. So I hid his toothbrush cord within the unit itself as well. And so there's less cords just all over. There's a little bit more room on the counter and we really like how it looks now. So if you don't already have an Alexa in your bathroom, make sure you order one of those and order the shelf because I promise it is really nice to have. Another thing that I keep on my bathroom counter are these makeup eraser wipes. Now these aren't regular wipes, they're microfiber cloths. And if you watched my women's gift guide video, you saw that I love these makeup eraser microfiber cloths. They remove all of your makeup super easily with just hot water water. So they're not single use, you know, wasteful chemicals, anything like that. But the only thing I don't like about my makeup eraser brand one is that it's just one large cloth. I can't use it like every single day without having to wash it every single time. So these individual cloths are so nice to have. I just use one a day and then I throw it in the wash and I have one ready every single day. Speaking of makeup this last year, I started wearing like face makeup. And so I had to buy some makeup brushes and makeup and it's all kind of new to me. But I also bought this makeup brush cleaner cleaning device and it's actually kind of fun. I think it's kind of extra. You don't really need it, but it's been nice to have. I just put a little bit of dish soap and hot 
filtered water in the little basin here. It's like silicone. It has these little grooves on the bottom to help get all that dirt and makeup out of your brushes. So all you have to do is rinse your brushes and then just agitate them on the bottom of this little thing. Cleanse your makeup brushes, then I rinse them again with hot water and then I just let them dry. So that's a good way to clean your makeup brushes so you're not spreading bacteria, disease, anything like that on your face through your makeup brushes. Okay, next come with me to our main floor living powder bath. This is a bathroom that I renovated last Christmas break and we changed out all the fixtures for matte black and gold and we really love it. I painted the walls a really pretty color called Black Magic and then I used a gold Sharpie paint pen in metallic gold and just freehanded a design on the walls. At this point, I really just do anything I can to avoid hanging and measuring and cutting wallpaper because it's like such a pain. Anyway, we changed all of the finishes like the little paper towel holder or the towel ring and the toilet paper holder and this one that I got, I just like, it just didn't work very well. It wasn't very functional. It kept coming off the wall. So I found this other toilet paper holder and it comes with an attached little box where you can put little things in there. You can put feminine supplies or wipes and it also serves as kind of a little shelf to put any of your belongings on there while you're using the bathroom. I think it looks really chic and it's really functional. It's a little bit of added storage in this room. So I really like it. Another thing that we put on this shelf is a spray called Poo Puri. Okay, if you haven't heard of it, it's a toilet spray where you spray an essential oil blend in the toilet before you go. If you catch my drift, I think everyone catches my drift. Anyway, it helps to lock in any unpleasant odors in the toilet and it doesn't cause a scene, let's say, for the next person who uses the bathroom. I really like taking this Poo Puri on vacation or you know, if you're sharing a room with other people it's really nice but we put it in this bathroom for sure because lots of people use it especially when we have you know groups over it's really nice to have okay my last favorite like absolute favorite product bathroom product are my water pick and my Sonicare toothbrush. I've mentioned these before, but they honestly are life changing. If you've never used a water pick before, it's basically a power washer for your mouth. It gets all the junk out of your teeth so you don't have to floss, you use the water instead, and it's so much more effective than floss. I swear if I had to choose between my toothbrush and my water pick for the rest of my life, I would pick the water pick. It's just amazing. And my teeth have never been better, never been cleaner. It's so good. In addition to that, I use the Sonicare Diamond Clean Toothbrush and it honestly has made my teeth so much cleaner. It gets like all the plaque out. It's like a noticeable difference between other electric toothbrushes I've used or just manual brushing. It really is worth it to have like a clean, beautiful, confident smile. Okay, this is the very last thing I promise. They are these teeth whitening strips. These are natural. They use really good ingredients and they were actually recommended to me by Carolyn from Just Ingredients. She shares the best products to buy with the best ingredients and they actually have been working. I really have been enjoying them and they don't give me like a sensitivity like some other teeth whitening strips. So these have been a really nice product to have. Okay, that's all the Amazon bathroom products I have for you today. Day. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this content, consider subscribing because this is an ongoing series. I love sharing my Amazon reviews. Check out this playlist right here with all of my other Amazon videos and we'll catch you on the next one. Okay, thanks, bye.